Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to my spare bedroom. Um, today we are going to be building a headboard for my, my spare bedroom to make it more of a finished room for my special guest that will be visiting me in July from very hot and very dry Texas. It's my best friend Forrest, so I'm very excited that she's going to be here. So I decided to build her a headboard for this bedroom. She stayed here before many a times and it's just a plain room, but I wanna make it more of a home away from home for her. So I'm going to build a headboard. This headboard is gonna be built out of three two by fours, two one by fours, and five cedar fence pickets that I ran through my planer to get all the roughness off. Um, so you can see the really pretty cedar grain that is underneath. Um, so we are going to be doing that. If you wanted to build this um, headboard, it'll approximately cost you around $50 for all the material. Um, so with prices, that's with these prices right now because uh, <laughs> the 2x4s are about $8.50, which they're normally about 2 bucks usually. Um, so if I mess this up, I'm going to be out some money. I mean, not a lot of money, but you don't want to mess up especially when you see the prices of wood and so we are going to be building it and i think it's going to turn out awesome and so let's go ahead and get started and see how it turns out and i hope you stick around and watch till the end and again thank you very much for being here um, if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that thumbs up bell, thumbs up leave a comment and hit that bell so if you want to see more of me and more of Ozzy and more of my builds, do that. All right, so let's get started.
All right, here it is. I think it turned out really amazing. Very farmhousey. I love it. I really love the way the cedar looks. I'm glad I took the time to go through that giant pile to find the darker tones because this looks awesome. So I'm probably going to keep this part, this color, um, and just put a polyurethane on it to bring out the natural tones of the cedar. Now with the outer part, I think I'm just going to do a uh, plain black because black goes with everything. Maybe a matte black. I think that'd be really pretty. And then we will install it and I'll show you the final product once we're done.